Good day, YouTube. This is Jay Money with Falling Forward Financial. Uh, just an update here on um, Oxley. Uh, I've talked about them on the uh, channel here a couple times in the past. And um, not a whole lot of information. Uh, it was time for an update, and I had a request to do an update on them, but um, couldn't find a whole lot of uh, updated information. So, going to be a short video for uh, Oxley. Currently on uh, Bing, showing it as a buy. Uh, so again, this is Oxley, um, the uh, group. And as you can see, trades over the counter. Ticker is CBWTF. Um, I can't buy this one on uh, Robinhood since it trades over the counter. Uh, you'd need to get it on uh, TD Ameritrade or uh, Fidelity. I usually buy on Fidelity. Last time I bought on there, you didn't have to uh, pay a commission, uh, which is nice. And but again, this is Oxley. Uh, here's a look at what they've uh, done over the last year, or <laughs> not done. Um, so again, like the other ones, uh, had the high there on uh, February 10th, and has came down um, since then. Kind of had a big drop off there again back in um, June. And you can see the volume pumping in there at times and had another run up here back in November and it's just been coming down ever since then so down in the last year it looks like it's down in the last month in the last week traded kind of flat pretty much overall in that 14 cent range and here's a look on uh, Friday currently at 14 cents and the markets are closed today so uh, this is a little bit older, but it's still uh, kind of relevant if you're looking to uh, Oxley. Uh, Canada's uh, bud tenders have spoken. Oxley brands uh, win big at the 2021 Kind Awards. Uh, this is dated on the uh, 16th. So you can see some of their uh, products here. They have uh, quite a few different products. I'll go ahead and list my uh, link in the uh, description so you can watch the other videos. kind of goes in over some of their products and their website. Uh, but they got the Strawberry Ice Sativa Cartridge, uh, named Best Sativa Cartridge at the 2021 Kind Awards. So a bunch of different uh, products. Fruit Indica Cartridge. Animal Mints. <laughs> so kind of interesting stuff that they have. 250 bud tenders recognizes Oxley brands with four wins at the uh, second angel kind awards So again, they're a leading consumer packaged goods uh, company in the MJ products market it is thrilled to announce the uh, company received four awards for its popular consumer brands uh, back 40 collab project uh, Dosican at the second annual kind awards so they did win some awards, and I'm just going to scroll through the uh, rest of the information here. Uh, again, you can find all this right on uh, Yahoo Finance. Um, rounding out uh, Oxley's kind of words, uh, recognized for its innovative uh, daily relief CBD cream, uh, which seems to be really popular, which uh, garnered the inaugural win for the uh, magazine's uh, new best topical uh, category. A CBD relief, uh, 1200 milligram. So they do have all kinds of products. Again, there's the uh, ticker CBWTF. And for more, go to uh, oxley.com. Uh, like I said, I'll link my other videos I've went there in the past. Uh, so they maintain a top position at the 2.0, dominates uh, vape sales, and grows national market share through 1.0 expansion in 2021. This is dated uh, last week on the uh, 13th. So securing a 15% uh, share of the uh, growing uh, category, up from 14% in 2020 as a uh, combined uh, by headset uh, Canadian Insight data. Companies number one spot driven by driven by its dominance in the vapor segment when it achieved a 23% national market share for the year with all three of its vape brands back 40 
collab project and foray securing a spot in the top five selling brands across the country. Company also set a steady quarter over quarter growth in total market share, achieving its strategic ob objective of reaching number five in overall sales by the end of 2021. Oxley going into next year, uh, where is the uh, leverage, the added support of its uh, newly acquired 1.1 million square feet greenhouse MJ cultivation uh, facility in um, Leamington, Ontario. The company also saw a steady quarter over quarter growth in total uh, market share, achieving its strategic objective of reaching number fifth LP position and overall sales by the end of 2021. Uh, 2021 was a phenomenal year for uh, Oxley. It uh, value validated our focus strategy of bringing innovative and differentiated products to a uh, Canadian MJ market uh, under brands that consumers can trust and love and I want to express my express my utmost gratitude to everyone at Oxley for their hard work and determination and um, we couldn't be more excited about 2022 same here I feel uh, 2022 uh, hopefully going to be a turnaround uh, for a lot of these uh, MJ plays um I mean, they're already at the bottom, so I just feel they can't go any lower, but uh, maybe they can. So, launch 52 SKUs in 2021, including uh, 10 first to uh, market innovations, uh, such as a uh, collab project, 232 series live terpene sticks, uh, made significant progress in building to leadership in both the uh, dried flower and pre-roll categories. Acquired the remaining equity interest in its uh, joint venture project. State of the art 1.1 uh, million square feet uh, greenhouse. MJ cultivation uh, facility in Leamington, Ontario. Strengthened its uh, board of directors for the appointment of Murray McGowan. So they have a lot going on. Um, So just need to get the uh, stock price up there to uh, reflect it over here on uh, Reddit. More good news. There's lots of good news uh, coming out. Um, undervalued Canadian stock. Um, I feel it's kind of undervalued for what all they have going on. Um, that's interesting. No data. Huh. They can develop... It cures cancer and the stock will continue to plummet. Stock is a legit. Huh. Another hot seller currently on the number one headset, Ontario Top Selling. Any buyers out there? I'm looking to buy some more of this one, so I just kind of buy this one and just kind of let it set and do its thing. And currently on uh, MSN Money, showing it as I buy. Over here on uh, tip ranks, currently showing it as moderate buy with a 262% upside to uh, 52 cents. And I don't know, definitely one to watch. They got a lot going on, interesting products, and it's got good ratings on it, even though it is a penny uh, stock. But um, you could buy quite a few shares of that one. So, but just a thought. So again, I don't give tax, legal, or trading advice. Just state my opinion as I like to uh, cover a lot of the uh, MJ plays. And wow, AT&T up to $27 range. I was buying some in 22 and 23 a month or so ago. But that's all that I have on uh, Oxley. If you have this one, go ahead and list it in the comments along with your cost bases. Any other information you'd like to share. And if you haven't smashed that like button yet, go ahead and hit that for me as well as subscribing and hit the bell so you're notified of when the next videos drop. And if there's any other uh, MJ stocks out there you want me to take a look at, I'd be happy to do that as well. And I thank you for all the uh, new subscribers and watching and uh, just keep uh, making videos here and um, getting the word out to you. So again, uh, thank you and uh, happy trading, happy investing, stay green. Cheers.